Hello, hello! It is finally Sunday, um, the 12th of February. Um, I am Creatrix Tierra, coming to you from Melbourne, Australia, also better known as the lads of the Boonwarong Warong people of the Kulin Nations. I pay my respects to the traditional custodians of the lands and to its elders, past and present, and to any indigenous people watching. Sovereignty was never ceded. This was and also the Aboriginal land. And yes, I've been away. Um, we had no stream on Tuesday and Thursday, partly because I am slightly unwell, <laughs> as you can probably tell. Um, won't get too much detail into it's a bit TMI. Uh, but also, you know, Thursday was going to be our Genshin Impact stream day. And then we found out um, that one of the VAs turns out to be a terrible person. And... Um, it, it like we found out that Thursday, uh, you know, my Thursday morning, and so it felt a bit tone deaf to try and do a stream uh, <laughs> on that day. Uh, so I opted against it. Um, if you have, I just sort of put it out there at the beginning. If you need resources on sexual assault or domestic violence, um, there is a website that I found called hotpeachpages.net. I know the name sounds a little bit dodge. I thought the same way too. But it's basically international resource for like domestic violence and sexual assault survivors. Like they have listings from different countries. It has a, it look, the website looks a bit old. Like it's like very like mid 90s graphic design, uh, you know, layout design. And also I think it was the last update was 2021. So, you know, it might not be necessarily as comprehensive for certain areas, but you know, if you want like all the resources in one place, that's probably a good place to start. Um, yeah, it was never your fault. If you've been a victim, it's never been your fault. Anyway, we aren't going to talk about more than that today. <laughs> Sorry from fuck Elliot. But anyway, so today, Saturday, not Saturday, <laughs> Sunday is the day that we do like games that have stage magicians in them. Um, you know, a stage magician plays games about stage magician. And we did Ace Attorney uh, for the past month. We finished off the Max Galactica case. I finally updated my YouTube channel with all the VODs. So if you go to youtube.com slash um, they should be on there. Uh, but, you know, Ace Attorney still has plenty of uh, magicians, uh, but we're going to take a break from the season a little bit and look at a game called Contrast. Now, Contrast is, I only just found this out today, but Contrast is made by the same people that do the game We Happy Few. So, uh, Compulsion Games, as you can see. And this is their first game. This was released in 2013, but I saw it because it was on the Game Pass. So I was like, oh, I'll check it out. And as you can tell from the music, it has, you know, an Art Deco 1920s cabaret vibe to it. <sighs> Where is Brad? I need Brad to be here. Um, so, I have played a little bit of this because I was interested in the idea. Uh, so, the idea is that you're playing this character who your main power is that you can, like, sort of transform into Shadow. Hi, Raging Richard. Uh, welcome to stream. Yeah, so you can transform into Shadow. So, there's like a sort of a light and shadow play happening. Um, and I played sort of like the tutorial level of it, right? And then I got to a point where there's a magician gets involved in there's a discussion that involves a magician or I think the magician's part of the discussion. I was like, ooh, ooh, that's like a really good like um game for this stream. And so I haven't I haven't like progressed part past that. Um because I wanna play it on the stream. So, you know, because I only just played a bit of the beginning, I think it wouldn't be too hard to like, you know, just start fresh. And you can see this game to start as well. So let's see. Let's open up and do a new game. Let's do a new game. Ah! Um, I did mention in, like, a previous stream that I was thinking of, like, experimenting with the overlay to make the game full screen and then, you know, like, do what people normally do. We just have a transparent chat and my VTuber on the corner. A, I've been unwell, so I haven't managed to work on that. But B, I realized because I only have one screen, I'm playing via the OBS, I would be blocking off my view a lot because there'll be stuff in the way on the game screen um if i had a second screen that that would not be a problem but like this like yeah i do have the border but at least this is somewhat see through so i'm gonna keep this for a little while maybe i'll change if i get like a tv <laughs> anyway okay the game got like mixed reviews but so far i seem to be liking it yeah so that's your player character um and you start off in this room and you know there's little hints for oh, so you get collectibles you can walk around and you see like oh 
Dee Dee's drawing of her family. So Dee Dee is this kid that you help out, right? And you see there's a mom, a dad, and a mysterious person named... No, you're Dawn. Not a mysterious person. You are Dawn. You are Dawn who is a... This, you're this kid's imaginary friend, basically. Um, oh, I guess it saves your collectibles from last time. Oh, yep. You can change the music. Let's keep the music on. Oh, I didn't realize she moved really slowly. What's this? Lights. Right. It's time for bed, Dee Dee. Go hop in bed. I'll be right in to tuck you in. That's Dee Dee. That's the kid you're the imaginary friend of. Like, as far as I can tell, that's what your deal is. Good night, Daddy. Yeah, so Dad's missing. What are you doing here? My mommy's coming. You better hide, or she's gonna catch you. That's the mom who... Okay, sweetie. Nice we only see him, Shadow. What are you looking at? I don't think you can see it. Now promise me you'll be a good girl while I'm out singing. I promise. No sneaking out this time. I'll get in trouble. I promise. That's my good girl. Mommy. Is Daddy ever coming back? I don't know, honey. Maybe someday when he's ready. Yeah, you're like the shadow of imaginary friend, but you only see back. the mom as a shadow, which is interesting. Wake up. Get some nice sleep. Okay, she's gone. She's gonna sing at the ghost note tonight. It's the most beautiful cabaret. Yeah, so like the kid's mom is a cabaret singer. And Hi, she sneaks off to like watch the show even though she shouldn't. <laughs> Join Didi on the rooftops. Great. A to jump. Boink. Ah. So yeah, it's kind of environmental puzzles. You can sort of run around. Oh no, somebody moved the ash cart. Look. I know. You can go down there and move the ash cart. And I can jump down. I'll play here. So you can go over there and be your shadow person. Shift into shadows, yep. New ability. Right trigger, right. So you change the shadow and see you can now interact with the shadows and wow, come out. I wish I could do that. Could you teach me how to do that? Um, wish I could, kid. So I know there was like a collectible up on that side of oops. See, like like you know, that's a block now. Ooh, can I not? I remember there being like a collectible on like that window and I don't think I've quite figured out how to get there yet so we need to go back down I hope we can so quiet okay now move the ash cart to where I can jump into it up oh, and now you have to move the thing oh never mind it tells you where to put it go down Do you think it was mommy? She got really mad at me the last time I snuck out. Where did you go for so long? I haven't seen you in three weeks. Ooh, you I really wish you had been at my birthday. Aww. Daddy missed my birthday. Happy birthday, kid. Now we go this way. Follow me. Right, so you've, you've met this kid. You sort of run around. Oop. It is a little bit annoying when you move like three oh, centimeters and a cutscene right. happens. <laughs> goes all the way through to the other street. If I move this cart, you could walk up its shadow. Couldn't you? Yep. Alright, so we go up here. A alright, oh right trigger to jump ship. Is there something that happens here? E Right. Uh, ooh, ooh, Come that's on, tricky. Be late for the show. How the? I'm doing what it asks. I'm just falling out the other side. Bah. 
Hang on. Come on, we're gonna be late for the show. Yes, I know, child. I don't remember it being this difficult when I first. There we go. There we go. You got to go now. Right. So you run around and you collect these things, luminaries, which you use for like other puzzles. You'll see. You'll see them in a second once I like get past this sort of shenanigans with the room. One of these, I feel like one of these windows had a, had like a thing you could collect, but uh, the camera is a little bit wonky. Right. How do I? I was hoping if I could like shift into this like sort of moving thing. Not letting me shift. Weird. Like you would think this is something you could shift into, right? But it's like not letting me. Oh, here we go. There we go. You sort of okay. So you need to find entry points to shift in. Oh, I managed to get up top of the wheel. Nope, that didn't work. Interesting. So you do need an entry point. So there's something with this wheel. That, because there's a luminary up on the window. But I haven't figured it out yet. I might figure it out later. So you can run around. Here's like this little town. I don't exactly know where it's supposed to be set, but it's, you know, it's like sort of 1920s jazz. Oh, cuts me. They haven't started the show yet. You missed the game. They were so beautiful. I want to be a dancer when I grow up. Or an acrobat, like you. Did you always want to be an acrobat? You're so good. You should be in the circus. You should be a second. Well, I'm dressed like an acrobat. Come on, let's go in. Yep, we're going in. So here's the jazz club. Here's where Dee Dee's mother works. And turn on some lights. I promise you'll like the view. Yep. Turn on the lights. You turn on a light. Or two or three. Uh. Come on, sugar. Help a girl out here. So you have to like aim the spotlights at the bed. So front. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We found a band member. Yeah, it's interesting. Aside from Dee Dee, everyone else is in ja shadow. So that's one. We're gonna find the second one, which is here. I know one of the spotlights is a bit broken. So <laughs> spoiler. This. All right, we found the saxophone. Come we found on, the drummer. Sugar. Help a girl out here. We can't play in the dark. Yes, yes, we're working on it. Ooh, something broke. Hey, hey one's on the fritz. Hey, Sparky, could you do something about that? One Sparky. <laughs> Prepare the spotlight. That involves going upstairs, which is how. Oh, right. I remember the sort of solution for this being kind of creative. So I think you have to sort of phase up to the saxophone. Yes. Aha, yes. Phase it using the saxophone and phase out. Can't imagine if this was like happening in this like IRL and the saxophone players like why is there someone stepping on my nose? All right, so we got the luminary. Remember from the beginning? Uh, you put that in. And now we move up and we got the piano. Just a thought 
Charlie, would you? This is this is where I wish I had like a proper like live 2D or 3D VTuber avatar, because you could see me dancing a little bit on my sofa. There's jazz in Ace. Hang on, sorry. Uh, no, uh, yeah, this is my friend Brad. I am, I forgot that I actually have full on jazz music, like a whole song. So he was asking like, cause we were playing Ace Attorney, so it's like, is there jazz in Ace? So he calls Ace Attorney, it's just funny. Like, no, but funnily enough, there's been a jazz album. Cause of uh, Godot, whose who's sort of theme music is kind of jazz. Right, so message to Brad sent. So she she's gone off. So Cat, Cat's the mom, and this is where this is where I stop. This is where I stop for reasons that will become apparent in two seconds. Well, not here. I think I stopped a little bit after the scene. But what are you doing here? I'm just saying good tonight, Cat. Don't smooth talk me, Johnny. We had an agreement. Is that what you call it? I never wanted to leave. You kicked me out. You want money from me, Johnny? Because I'm ducking the land. I don't need a handout, Dang. babe. Look at this suit. You work in another one of your famous deals? This one's big, cat. Oh, sure it is. Till it blows up like last time and the time before Not that. Not this time, babe. I'm going to make it all up to you. I got to get back on stage. Then meet me after. I'm staying at the Excelsior. Dump him. You're just going <laughs> to jitterbug your way back into our lives with a lot of sweet talk. It's going to be better this time, babe. You're going to see how much better it can be. Room 529, kiddo. 529, when they give you conspicuous numbers like that, it means you have to go there. Also, dump him. Where is he going? I need to talk to him. Of all the gym joints, act one. So yeah, it was around here. So I did the tour. Oh my God, the camera. You know, now that I know that this is made by the We Happy Few people, I see the art style now. I played a little bit of We Happy Few. What's here? Ooh, I got a thing. Insufficient funds. Check from Johnny Penrith to Cat. <laughs> I was trying to like silent K the cat. Cat Knight, insufficient funds. Interesting. Oh, some of these I got from uh, the playthrough. Um, so yeah, you, you collect th things in the game that give you clues to what's going on. Where are we going? Yeah, seeing like now that I know it's from the people did we happy few I finally see like the character model is very similar. So we're in this alleyway. Is there anything of interest here? No, not really. The game saving. Um Hello. This Dee Dee. I bet she's going to the bar today. Mommy said daddy left her. But that's not true, is it? She kicked him out. Good for her. It won't open. But you could break it open. You're pretty strong. Can I now? I can break it open. Pow pow. This way. Should try it on the wheel later. Oop. Right, I think this is where I got. He's a world famous illusionist. Ta da! What's daddy doing with him? Ta da! Here's your magician. Here's your magician. Vincenzo the Illusionist, here is the magician. How important is he to the story? I can't tell you. 
I have not looked uh, up the plot. So it's just some film footage of your act. Why can't you let me borrow it just overnight? Because <laughs> it is my new act and it's top secret. That's which actually is very why legit. My agent has it safely locked in his office. Upstairs. They're very protective about the documentation. To, show it to, my to their detriment sometimes. To know you better. Mr. Fenris, this I is why you get a show reel. Act for the King of England and the Emperor of Japan. There are he, this is great as the canon. <laughs> stories of the amazing Vincenzo. If your investors don't know me, they're not in show business. You think I can't pay you? Look at Bro, get a show reel like everyone else. At the Excelsior Hotel. I've asked around about you, Mr. Fenris. People tell me not Fenris. to trust you. And I've asked around about you, Mr. Amazing. You're not as flush as you look. You've got a few debts. <laughs> True. Which is why I think you'll perform at the opening night of my circus. You dare accuse me. Oh, he runs a circus, okay. Beautiful poster. Now I just need to borrow your film reel. Until I see some earnest money from you, I'm damned if I will lend you the time of day. All right. I mean, I'll a get fair call. Check. Cash. Cash, don't. Yeah, because he gave I'll the dud check to Cat. Yeah. It's been such a pleasure meeting with you. Oh, God, he's tall. Right, so this is where I stopped. This is where I stopped and decided to play this game on stream. I do not know what happens from here on out. So, this will be news to both of us. Alright, so we need to find the film reel. This. Okay, so we get to move an object, which I'm assuming we need to move this. Right, so that we can get to that shadow. Okay, cool. Because we need that ledge. What's here? The controls are a little bit janky. I got a thing. World's Fair, the Great Vincenzo. That's not a terrible poster. All things considered. Ah, oops. Ah! No, 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 no. No, don't restart. Ugh. The controls are just a little bit too slippery. Ah, God, that nearly was a disaster. So that was to move the thing. Mm hmm. I'm playing this on the Xbox One, in case that wasn't obvious. On the Game Pass, so. Okay, can we, can I phase in, please? Oh my god. Phasing is so tricky. Ah! Yeah, it's just like, ugh. These controls are like, water. Okay. Um, I got to the ledge. Right, that that isn't high enough for me to be useful. Oh, is it? Oh, okay. I just had to sort of get up there and jump off shadow. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. Is there anything else? Note here. No, there's a balcony. All right, so I'm at the balcony. Is there anything of note in this direction? Yes, there's a cage. Not a cage, it's a ca balcony cage, I guess. Um, stairs. Where does the stairs take me? Is this door openable? No. Are there shadows in any area? No, but I do see a luminary thingy. Ah, oh, oh, okay. I missed the hint to phase in. Great. Now I have to go all the way back up again. Oops. Can I? Can I get back up? Daddy's gonna get into trouble without that movie reel. We have to get it for him. Thanks, Dee Dee. I know I fucked up. Alright, so let's try that again. Now that I know what I'm meant to be doing. Um. Oops. Phase out too early. Phase out. Jump. Jump. Ooh. Ooh, that jump. I do not like games where the jump is super tricky. Honest to God. How did I do this? There we go. Okay, so jump and then phase out. Alright, so now that we know what we went to do, there is a shadow on the side of the wall. Hello, don't jump. Right, so this is shadow. Can I? Right, okay, jump in. We found, we found a luminary, great. 
So we get into this room. Upstairs. It's very confusing that we are getting upstairs. There's a few things to collect here. Let's sort of go from outside in, I guess. This is, we got a thing. M newspaper article, the amazing Vincenzo hides his secrets in plain sight. Whoa. Um, I believe Penn and Teller did a similar thing where they did a show where it was sort of supposedly teaching you how they do their tricks but then like even with like transparent props and everything it was still kind of like weird and magical how they did it so it's like so you're like how the hell did they pull that off <laughs> okay resume all right so that's definitely for me yep bring the reel to the cinema so we were just there and can i i can't go in that room here, can i so i'm gonna point is this it is this the cinema or have i gone the wrong room because this feels like a projector right oh no i have to go the other direction right 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 let me see let me let me try it Come on. Right, why do you run off the other direction? That, okay, yeah, that was the thing that was a bit annoying was that I, I, like, I would jump and then immediately run off into the wrong direction. Maybe I need to move this a little bit more this way. Let's see that. No. Because I'm assuming the cinema is up here. But I do not know how to get up there. Is there like a slightly. Hello? Oh, okay. <laughs> Never mind. I'm just following this child. <laughs> yeah, but just like the blaster. I do, child, actually. I just picked up a few on the way here. Ta-da! Oh, we need more. I need one more. Right, so I need to find a luminary somewhere in this world. Do we now have enough to capture that one luminary that's like hanging off a window? There is also that. Where are you? Ooh. Ooh! Hello! Hello! This is literally step on me, mommy. Okay, I step on you, mommy. <laughs> the game. So I need to get on this, this woman's legs. This is must be cat. Yeah! Ooh! Hey, Brad! Oh no! Okay, so I have a timer. Interesting. Come on, let me feed him. You came in a good time, Brad. Oh, except it's not going to a good time for me because this thing is. <sighs> the controls are janky. Ah! So I'm trying to like get on her shadow basically, but in time. Because I need this one shiny thing. So you're going to hear the same jazz tune for like 500 times. There we go. Why? 
why would you not let me phase in? That's so annoying. Like, I'm, I'm hitting the right trigger, but it's, like, not doing anything. Come on. Thanks. See, like, I'm hitting it. Not that, you, not that you can tell, because you can't see my hands. But, there we go. Okay. So, I have decent reach with my jump. There we go. Okay, great. Sorted. I know, right? Yeah, I mean, it's it's the came from twenty thirteen, so I'm not gonna like complain too much, but I will complain. <laughs> There's a little bit of, like the jazz cabaret for you. So that's the kid. So we so so Brad to sort of catch you up on what this game is. We are like this imaginary friend of like this kid who's somewhere. Oh, that's a kid, and you're sort of figuring out like. Your mom is, who's that woman in the shadow, is a cabaret singer. There's some sort of money thing happening with her dad. And now there's a magician involved. And so, yeah. You get to travel in shadow. Who's this? Hello. Um, so. Faced in. Magician. Yes, the great Vincenzo. Who, your dad, your, your, not your dad, your you're sort of like kid's dad. Ah! <laughs> I did not realize you could die in this damn game. Oh, I got an achievement. When the player falls into the void on the way to the center. <laughs> oh my god. Well. At least they reward me for my failures. That's nice. Oh, come on. What do you want me to do? Yeah, so like this great Vincenzo, the dad character is like, Hey, give me your film reel. I needed to promote you in my show. And Vincenzo is like, fuck though, that's my top secret act. And but you... Ah! <laughs> Are you going to spend like 10 hours here just trying to figure out how to do this? I did not realize it would be this hard. Like, I need to get to that middle bit, I think. But it's not letting me. Wrong. Because, <laughs> right, like, I... I oh, 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 come on. So, I, okay, so I got forcibly shifted out. I can't stay in shadow forever. Come on, I feel like I feel like there's a trick to this that I'm not noticing. Like, do I have to fix the sign? Because it feels like I need to fix the sign. How do I? How do I? Yeah, I feel like there's something about the sign that's important. Oh, oh, oh! That was almost a thing. Do I have to fix the sign? I can't fix the sign from where I am. Pro gamer moment, guys. Ah! Let's see. Let's see. I might have to do something. So! I was thinking I could, like, pop out and jump immediately afterwards, but I didn't get the, like, the timing wasn't right. Oh my god. I'm not going to be stuck on this damn section forever and I quit the game. See? Like, ah! It's not, why is it not responding to my triggers? I'm gonna have to walk through this damn game. I'm stuck here. See, like, ah, see, it won't let me jump, which is a bit weird. Because I feel like that's the thing you need to do. But I'm gonna hang on. Instead of you, you listening to me go whoop, I am going to. Um, too bad there's no more jazz music you can interfere with. Uh, figure out what to do here because I am stuck. Con. Trust. Walk through. Act one. 
right. How is everyone doing on this Sunday? Um, cinema sign. Yeah, 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 I got it. You need to jump across a gap, shifting back into the shadows mid-air. Right. So I had the right idea. I just don't have the right timing, I guess. So I need to jump. I shift back. Yes! Aha! Got it. Got it. All right, cool. Thanks for the walkthrough. <laughs> Confirming what I needed to do. It's too far. Can you help me? Please? Um, sure. I don't know. Oh, to break weak structures. What, what do you need to break? Is this... Oh, ah! <laughs> uh, oh, good. I was like half expecting. What do you? Okay, so that looks like I need to break it. Donk. And jump. And donk. This causing property damage. Why don't you? I'm gonna travel this Good direction. Such a big jump. Here we go. Here's the cinema. Wee. Oh, it's locked. Surprise. Oh wait. Think I can just. I yeah. I was good at fixing things. So this is the cinema. We're gonna see this magic act. Oh, there's people here. Maybe you could find another way in. Into the theater. What's all this? Oh, okay. So I'm guessing you need to build like some sort of platform using the stand ins. No, I don't need the. I'm gonna not move the Fred Astaire. Okay, so that moves her. I'm trying to move this guy in the front. How do I? There we go. Oh, you can move it. How many? Oh, you can move it sort of all sorts of ways. Interesting. So clearly it's something to do with like the hands m meeting up. Right, because it is, is a perspective puzzle, ultimately. So let's try that. I think it's not high enough. Yeah, it's not quite... Yeah, it was not high enough. I mean, like, I, it's a bit too high for me. But I think we've got the right idea. So I just need to move Fred Astaire back a little bit. So I can jump on. And then move Nosferatu a little bit further back so that they connect and then this other jazz cabaret singer no that is not about to um give me give me give me her thanks oh come on oh is she in the right spot and that's why it's not letting me like do anything with her interesting okay well let's try this let's try this Still think potentially not in the right spot, but okay. So we're here. Oh, I see a problem. I need to get up. Oh, here we go. Yep. Hey, got him. And now I'm stuck. There's Vincenzo. So quiet suddenly. We got a thing. Prison release, Johnny A. Fenris crime, passing bad checks. Johnny Fenris commits tax evasion. Am I allowed? In here? Yes. Aha. I hear a projector. Where is the projector? 
dévier. It's actually somewhere here, isn't it? I hear it. I feel like I'm getting further and further away from this projector. But I'm not seeing like sort of the glowy lights of here's an interactable. You had to go down the stairs. Oh, okay. Yep. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be out this late. Where's your mom? Did mommy really kick you out? Were you <laughs> spying on us at the cabaret? Are you coming home? <laughs> That's my plan. I've got to convince your mother. Is she here? No, I snuck out. Oh boy, you're growing up fast. You used to be scared of the dark. Scared of the dark? My best friend's a shadow. Well, yeah, kind of. At the time, I wasn't being very good to her, so I guess I had it coming. I missed you so much. He I had it coming. <laughs> he had but it I'm coming. Back home. I'm putting together a circus, see? It's gonna pay for everything. And you know who it's gonna star? The amazing Vincenzo. <laughs> How much snooping around have you been doing? Yeah, Second time we're playing a game involving a circus with a magician as their lead performer. Look, you're really not supposed to be out this late. I'm, I'm Which is interesting I'm given that sh circuses with magicians that they lead performers are actually that common now. Yeah. Investors come in here and they don't like kids much. I need you to run home by yourself, okay? But I brought Dee Dee, you, you have to get out of here. I won't tell mom you snuck out. Now, even a really clear lady magician, which is supported by Woman Circus, that was still a little bit of a novelty among circus people here. Like, I feel hey, like magic and circus kind of live in two different worlds here in Australia. <laughs> His name is Salvio, so why are we here? Salvio, yeah, what did I say? I got great news. Vincenzo is in. You got him? You're sure? Sure, mm -hmm. I'm sure. He's going to play opening night. Really bring in the crowds. So that's why you brought us here, huh? You're going to show us his act? Yeah, yeah, except uh, the projector's broken. Because if you don't, <laughs> the projector's your broken. circus is going to flop and you're not going to be able to pay us back. And then I'm going to have to break your arms and then we'll see how well you swim. Look, I'm going to need just a little more money to uh, finalize things with the chance. Are you kidding me? We'll just spend our money on that stupid. Listen, it's all going to come back to you. Oh! Show them the movie. Show them the movie. Right, yes. There's the projector. How do I get in the projector room? It's open, never mind. Um, ooh. Oh, do I need to shadow face my way in? There we go. Hello. Oh, oh, you broke my finger. oh no. Oh. Hey, knock it off, Sal. Check this out. Jeez, he is amazing. <sighs> I told you I got him. Okay, let's go get your money. Thanks a bunch. That's very quick. Look, why don't I swing by tomorrow? When they play it, let's take <laughs> <laughs> very hot, Johnny. I was too slow. The guy will fix that thing right up. Wow, okay. You get achievements for failure state. Huh? She must be a real ripe tomato. <laughs> you want to go meet Johnny's tomato, Sal? I like a ripe tomato. That tomato. tomato my wife. Really? She always wanted to meet the wife. Uh, we'll play canasta. Just the four of us. Hmm? Okay, but he's not asking Johnny. He's telling. <laughs> no. I feel like if they know there's a kid involved, they go after the kid. Unlock when the player leaves the scene. Why? Why is this an achievement? Are we meant to be stuck in the cinema? <laughs> I guess it's sort of like, you've moved on to the next act. Alright, shadows. Oh, what is this? Oh, no. I do not like the sound of these timers. I, ah, uh, yep. Yep, as I expected the sort of wind up doll sounds do not do not like uh 
Well, I guess, you know, them being open is kind of what's in my favor a little bit. Oh! Oh, never mind. I see what I need to. Oh, this is a weird timing thing. Okay, I have an idea of what needs to happen. But the timing is a bit tricky because... How would you do this? Because I think the idea is to get on top of this big umbrella, but you have to do it in a way like the second umbrella does not open. So you need to give it a bit. Hello? Aha! <laughs> no! Oh, I had the right idea. I had the right idea. I had the right idea. One, two, three, four, five. Right, wait for this guy to open. Jump, jump, run. Yeah! Oh! Ooh, why did I phase out? Why did I phase out? Why did it phase me out? It shouldn't phase me out. Right, okay, that was weird. Let's try this again. One, two, three, four, five. God, timing puzzles. So I knew this was going to be a timing based puzzle like you'd have tried this game. Okay, great. Okay, now. Phase out. Ta -da! Got him. Did I need to do anything else? No. Can I bash this door? Yes. <laughs> Where am I? I'm gonna be in a cafe situation. Hello, what's this? I have picked up a thing. Due to change in management, we are currently closed for business. Okay. Don't know what this is. Don't know where Tiny Child has disappeared to. There's always a tiny child in these games. So many tiny children. Come on. Give me, give me something with the jazz music. Ooh, what the? No. Where am I supposed to be going? Hello. Can I, do I have a shadow I need to phase into? This is, okay, so this is a cinema of some description. This might be a cinema with just that. But. Go to, get to the hotel. Okay. That will teach me to learn how to read. Uh, so I need to get to the hotel. How do I get to the hotel is my question. Oh, it's right over there. So I need to get across. Yes, back. Okay, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. I understand now. Ah! Oh, God. That's the hotel. There is one of those luminary things closer to the start. But I might deal with that later. We might have more things to like unlock. She was getting pretty loud in there. See? Near music. You meet a guy's wife. Now he's got a whole new reason to make good. How come you know so much? Cause my ma used to smack me every time I didn't know. I should try that with my kids. Good parenting advice? No. <laughs> oh, Didi got here way before us. I can't get in. The door's locked. I need your help. Oh, jeez. All right, so I need to get onto the lift somehow. What am I meant to be interacting with? This. Where does this take me? That feels like an open lift. What bow? Crashed. Okay. 
Ooh. A to pull up from a ledge. Okay. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Ah, we needed that for that one luminary at the beginning. All right, up we get. Did that help me in any way? I don't know. Did she say the fifth floor, not ninth floor? I mean, fifth floor is still high, but it's not as high as ninth floor. Uh, what am I? Okay, so it's telling me to shift in because there's still shadows I need to negotiate with. But this is a little bit too high for me. But like, I think I'm getting like something of an idea. Yeah, this shadow's a bit too high. Uh, what happens if I interact with the lift? Oh, the door half opens. Did that change anything? No. Okay, no, bashing the door does nothing. Hmm. Obviously, there's something to do with, like, these shadows that I need to do to negotiate my way up, but... I have a walkthrough open, so if I get like super stuck. Ah! Don't face me out. Right, so I get st stuck here. Hang on, I'm just gonna look this up. Inside the cinema, yep. Yeah. yeah, just the walls. Hotel, yep. Look to your right for every call button and go to the other side of the building. Oh, there's two cranks. Okay. Right. I didn't see the kind of like sort of spinny interactable thingy. Oh, there is that. <laughs> now that I can see them. Okay. Oh, okay. Yep. Aha. Uh -huh. Yep. Got it. Yeah, so you need to move this guy here. I'm just going to walk through at this point. And then this. Meow. There we go. So I might need to make this a little bit lower. Yep. Aha! So... Maybe you're able to phase in from here, are we? Yep. Yep, boink. Ooh, almost. Wee, and then wee. And phase out. Ta-da! Third floor. There's like vague jazz music. This, what does this do? So this was sort of things up and down. Oop. There's the elevator. Is there anything on this side of the room? Not well sort of you can fall off. Pull the fire alarm nearby. Alright. Oh, so that was the thing I rang. Pull the fire alarm nearby. Ah, right. I need this to, like, get me up there. Whoops. My bad. Let me try this again. Right, because I knew, knew there was something so shifty about all this. Was I meant to shift? Oh my god. Ah! 
Ah, okay, yep. Never mind. I see what I'm gonna be doing. Oops, not there. Yeah, 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 this the steps. Right, yes. I see now. I see now. I see now. I see now. Timing. Run! Oh! Oh! Oh, I had the right idea. I had the right idea, but I was not fast enough. Wait, what? Okay, yep. Oh, there's a lift there. Hang on. I need to, like, get rid of the lift. That'd be why. Timing puzzles are the death of me. And I can't do this thing which I sometimes do if I'm stuck on a timing puzzle, which is to like get someone else to do it for me. <laughs> Cause I am playing this alone. There we go. Back on the third floor. How? Oh, my God, how? Oh. I know the idea. I do not have the timing chops for it. Sorry, I know this is not terribly entertaining to see me like fail 500 times. I would like to not rage quit this game, guys. <laughs> Wait, hang on. Oh, this is it's resetting it to a point that's uh, almost useful for me. Spoke too soon. Tiring puzzles are indeed the worst. Ah! I have rage quit games that rely too much on timing puzzles. Like I don't care with a like, game of the year or whatever. It was a timing puzzle. I'm just like no. Especially with like this, where it seems like the controls are a little bit jank. I guess like it didn't quite port. But like I guess to, to my to my solace, I guess the game did get reviews for glitchy controls, so so you know I'm not just bad at gaming. Ugh. I need to lower this. Vision. I feel like there's been I've seen a couple of games. It's not very common, but I've seen games where uh, there's an option for like oh I think it was the Sherlock games that had it, where they had an option for like look I've tried this five hundred times can you just let me pass already? <laughs> there has to be an easier way to do this. Oh, why am I phasing out of the wall? Hang on, I'm gonna like see if anyone's done this section. 
If you fall, don't worry. You can reset the elevator on third of co- uh, third floor versus the call button. The position of the cranks for everyone has been the same. Yeah, I know. I know. The, the, the problem is I do not know how to like get past this damn wall. Contrast. Walk through. Oh, someone's. Is it free? It has been a game pass for free for a year. For a year now, I never like noticed. Hang on, I've I've I pulled up a a thing on YouTube just to like figure out how to do this. Yep, food. So I don't know what the name of this section is. No, that's not it. Right, here's the thing where you have to go up. 500 levels. Let me just see. I mean, it might just be me with bad timing. Yep, so, the, so the, I'm just looking up a walkthrough on YouTube, which is why. I mean, there was a way you could like play some music while you wait. Do 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 do. We had a bit of music from Aries Beats. No, the song is called No. Yes, the so- the band is Aries Beats. Uh, I guess the band meaning one DJ. Uh, but the song is called Upbeat. Theme song for Queen Lady Magician. Also not theme song for when I get fed up with these games. Music, yes, not jazz music. I feel like I need to find like the next time I do these games. Oh, I forget the elevators anyway. Um, to like match the vibe of the game a little bit i've just watched the walkthrough um it seems to be a little easier than i thought it would be i sort of had a i just need to go to the other side but yeah it's still it's still a type matter of timing but the person who walked through i just watched did also struggle a little bit but he figured it out so don't tell me to be crank this because the walkthroughs are like, oh, you know, if you if you fall, that's fine. You can just go here. The cranks will be in the right spot. They are not. There we go. Right, so... So there possibly is a way to do this. That might be a little easier than what I've been attempting this whole time. Ah, yeah, so, oh, I, it's the timing, timing, and this is a, just a little bit jacky. At least I didn't fall. At least I didn't fall. I need to get to that ledge and then wait, but the timing for phasing in is very tricky. Hang on. Run! Ah, see, I keep getting phased. Oh, I'm falling. Ugh. I keep getting phased out. I feel like this game should not let you phase out. If the game did not, like, force you to phase out, 
Um, I feel like that would make things 500 times easier. I mean, like, of course you have to phase out at some point, but like, if the game didn't forcibly phase you out, I think that would make things 500 times easier. Because then you could just wait, right? You could just wait and then phase out at your own time. There we go. Yeah, I meant to sort of basically end up here when the fire alarms go off and then I can jump to that ledge, but it won't let me. Unless... Oh, no. No, no, it goes up too high. No. Right, I guess they do that because it gives you time. Aha! Ah, finally! There we go, finally, after 500 hours. Whew. Maybe you could sneak in through a window or something, and then you could let me in. Oh, God. Okay, please, no more timing puzzles. Yeah, this, 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 let me smash. Oh! Really? Really? Now we have to do a balance puzzle with very, very janky controls. Oh, dear God! Ugh. What did I say about timing puzzles? What did I say about timing puzzles? Also, why? <laughs> why is this black suddenly? Why'd you have to come back, Johnny? Uh -huh. I want to come home, Cat. And you got another pot of gold at the end of the rainbow? That's the past, Cat. I've changed. Oh, yeah? You ride the you foot up. Religion? I got lonely. I miss you, baby. I'm never going to give you another reason to kick me out, I swear. Never's a big word. Feels like I heard it before. This time you're going to be you. nothing but proud of me. Look at this hotel suite. I got investors. The ones who just left? Yeah, I'm real proud. Ah! <laughs> God damn it, why can't you let me like splatter from that area? What? Oh pfft. What am I trying to describe as like the timing with this? It's like yeah, the timing is one issue, but I think also it's just something about the velocity is just back, very Johnny? fast. I wanna come home, cat. The you got another pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Okay. That's the past, cat. I've changed. Oh yeah? You get religion? I got lonely. Oh! I miss you, baby. I'm never gonna give you another reason to kick me out. Oh! Don't phase me out! Don't phase me out of the wall. If you could avoid this one situation, that would make this game Why you have 500 times easier. Johnny? I wanna come home, Cat. And you got another pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. That's the past, Kat. Right. I thought this oh, was yeah? a frying pan. You get religion. I got lonely. I Wee. miss you, baby. I'm never going to give you another reason to kick me out, I swear. Oh, you know, no. Feels like I heard it before. Oh, pff. Hey. Hang on. I'm going to, like, look at my walkthrough again. Yeah, wooden barricades. Stand the foot. Cigarette. Run across her head to Johnny's arm. Okay. Okay, so I need to get on his hat. I got off too early. Okay. Why do you yep. have to come Hello. back, Johnny? I'm gonna go right on your foot, home, please. Cat. And you got another pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Thank you. That's the past, cat. I've changed. I don't like oh, that yeah? they give you like two you opportunities. Get religion? I got lonely. I miss you, baby. I'm never gonna give you another reason to kick me out, I swear. Okay, never go ahead. Feels like a ah! This time you're gonna be nothing but proud oh. of me. Look at this hotel suite. I got nope. investors. <laughs> the ones who just left? Ah, uh, screaming yeah, prematurely. Really They're the ones who I actually kind of right? needed to get there. <laughs> you don't believe a word you're saying. Okay, okay, I know, we're, we're good. We are good. We're good. Ignore me, Johnny. Not again. You're a carousel of broken dreams. You keep coming around and around. No one Damn. is ever gonna love you like I do, kiddo. Get back. Don't try and kiss me, Johnny. I'll lose my mind. You gonna shoot me? Ah, uh, go ahead and shoot. I got two holes in me where you and Dee Dee used to be. Put mm. another one in there. Finish me off. 
What do you want with Dee Dee? You're not even her real father. <gasps> you think Vincenzo's real? All he ever gave Dee Dee was her cute little nose. Oh my Dee Dee God! Father, but I'm the one that showed her how to tie her shoes. I'm the one that put her to bed when you had to stay out late. You took her to see his show. Did he change his mind? He doesn't want to be her father. He doesn't want to be anybody. I hate you. Dun dun dun. Stop! What are you doing? No, nothing. Mommy and Daddy were having a little fight. It's not a real gun. It's just a toy. Yeah. Yeah, it's just a toy, Dee. Mommy, are you gonna let Daddy come home? Dee, which Daddy Please? though? Please let Daddy come home. He's in pretty deep with some bad people, Dee Dee. Maybe he should make good with them first. Right, Johnny? Maybe I'm no good without my family. Maybe I need my family to make good. Um, Excuses. Yeah, Daddy needs us. If this is another train wreck, it's not just going to be you and the train this time. I'm not going to let it wreck this time. Promise. I've missed you so much. Yay, Daddy's coming home. I'm surprised he didn't use like I am I I have your kid as kind of blackmail material to the magician, but ooh oh, all right, completed Act One after like fifty billion jumps later. I mean that was a, that was a very quick twist. The kid seems to take it fine. I thought the kid would be like, <gasps> unless the kid knows. The kid might know, but. Oh, hello. It's you. Where have you been? Did you know the circus is in town? It's Daddy Circus. He says it's gonna be the biggest thing ever. Except he always says stuff like that, and then something goes wrong. And Vincenzo's my real dad. We have to go talk to him. Apparently, it was a way to have that conversation without Dee Dee listening, but I don't. <laughs> I didn't know that I realized I had to do that, but. Okay, so we're in Act 2. I just want to look at the walkthrough super quickly just to see if there was like a way to get that first luminary. Because um, I thought we needed like maybe more power. Uh, or like more skills. And the walkthrough doesn't say. But, um, alright. Music! Give me the music. Or not. There was music playing. Who's this? They're so happy. There aren't any pictures of the bad times. These were in the basement. She only takes them out when Daddy's living with us. You know when stories where the little girl is really a princess and her parents aren't really her parents? Uh huh. Does she still get to see them? Is she is the mom also not her mom? Is that what's happening? Is that the second twist? When oh, in fact, we <laughs> all right, great. Where am I going? Downstairs. Oh no! It's an eviction notice. Daddy says he's gonna pay all the bills when the circus is a big hit. He has no money. Come on. Let's go find Vincenzo. I know you're my dad. <laughs> we got a thing. Letter from Cat to Child Services. Please don't take my daughter away. I I know that the, the thing has legible text. It's too small for me to see where I am. So I'm just gonna maybe look at that later. Go to the second cent. All right. Can I? When is shadow to clear through the dash through the shadows? Oh, okay. Needed that way earlier. All right. Bye. Uh. What is this city built on? Like, why? Why am I? Are we up in the air? Where are we? Why do I end up in the void? Oops. A, B to jump, shadow dash. The fuck? Oh.
Ugh. Uh -huh. Well, at least, at least we don't have to, like, go through all of that again. Aha! <laughs> Nailed it. First try. <laughs> Where am I going? Here? There's a circus tent. Are there even circuses hey, that do this tent anymore? I've been in a big club a big once. I don't really know excited. You're gonna have to give them their money back. What? We're sold out. You haven't paid me. I got the money. We're selling out. You'll have it before the show. Even if you do, I can't perform here. I feel Your old. circus is by a ghost disaster. Queen it's coming money. together. Your puppet show about the princess is missing the princess. You've lost your hot air balloon. And where did you get that pirate ship? It is a broken down piece <laughs> of junk. Come on, Vincenzo. It's ah, the pearls of stations. There's always a few wrinkles to iron out. Look, I'll get That's why you need a tech free. rehearsal for. No problem. Consider Although I would like... All right. Second night was chaos. We had so many things go wrong. That lures people into your scrapyard. He's so mean. I'll get it fixed. I promise. Or am I dead, man? I'm worried about Daddy. He always says it's okay, but those gangsters really hurt him. We have to fix the circus so Daddy will be safe. Come on, it's this way. Anything of interest here? Ta da! And now for my next trick. Players choose the circus that towards the attractions. Okay. Or you just mess around on stage. Right, where am I going? Oh, I've lost the tiny child. What is this city built on? Why does it look like it's floating on air? Is there anything on this side? Ooh, shadowy things, yes. Oop. Oh, I forgot what the dash button was. I phased out. That, okay, that one was my bad. <laughs> that one was my bad for phasing out when I didn't need to phase out. I was supposed to like jump dash, but I pressed the phase out button instead. I died to my, I fell to my doom. Ooh, 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 that was close. Ah! Damn it, again. Fa okay, dash button is B. I need to remember this. It, it's not, the phase out button is the right trigger. God. Oh, come on. <laughs> Play some jazz music game to to hide my failures. Ah oh Oh did it too early. Got the right button. Did it too early. I don't even know what's on that side. I don't think the kid went that way. But I'm gonna follow the shadows anyway. Oh, could have avoided all this if I remembered what the buttons were. Stop phasing me out when I didn't ask to. Ugh. Room. This is gonna end up being nothing, and we wasted like five minutes on this jump. Okay, don't face jump now. Not face jump, don't dash jump now. Alright, I can't like dash through. Ah! Oh! Oh! I did it again. I pressed the wrong button. That was entirely on me. Oh my god, this is suddenly so hard. 
Wait. This feels like where I was meant to be going with all of that. Right? Will it let me? No. <laughs> I thought there might have been a way across without the shadows, but no. Nah, it wants you to do the shadows. I know what. Th I feel like as I mentioned, like there should be a way for like I tried. The oh, there's all this stuff I haven't noticed. Where am I? Oh well, I'm gonna ignore all that then. I'm gonna go here instead. What's happening? Is this a collectible? This is the thing. It's a shadow thing. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, I've ignored the asteroids for now. I feel like that's like a thing. Oh no. I'm stuck here. Oh. Come on, how can I jump in your head and now you're not letting me? Hello. Okay, yep. Okay, yep. Ah! Oh. Ooh, the angles do not forcibly phase me out. Oh, my God. This is meant. Oh, there's a type. There's a hack. <laughs> They're not timeies. Timeies are from Isomnia Fast. Completely separate game. Ooh, ooh, oh. Why is it possible for me to like phase out automatically but not phase in? What's up with that? Oh. I feel like they're going to make this necessary, but I'm going to ignore that. And only come back to it if I absolutely need to. Because that seems very difficult. Hey, has anyone seen the princess puppet? We can't really start the story without her. That seems like daddy. Ah, Fill the role of the princess. Here. Okay. What do you need me to do? A sort of princess hat. I know she's around here somewhere. <laughs> a princess hat. Ah, there she Hello. Is. We're doing a tea the shirt off. Time, there was a princess who lived in a castle with her father, the king. The king loved her very much Yay. because daddy loved her that much. Well, I can skip this. The kingdom also had an ogre <gasps> who was eating travelers because ogre. So the king did what kings do and promised that anyone who slew the ogre would get to marry his only daughter, the princess. <laughs> it doesn't and give you a lot of options to act. When he died, the king's lands were very far away and the ogre was very large. So only one knight showed up. His okay, name was, was the knight. And he fell immediately in love with the princess. Hello. Fred was a brave knight, Fred. and he marched off the next morning, singing a brave song. Oh, Brad, I hope you feel better. After several days had passed, the princess got to wondering 
what had happened to her future husband. So she set off into the forest to look for him. The princess tracked Fred's footprints Ooh, through a strange bye. wilderness full of scary sounds and hidden dangers. Chasms filled with razor-sharp bamboo. Bye, Fred. Fortunately, she was a very brave princess who loved adventure, just like you. She used her wits to get past unexpected obstacles. <laughs> Such as. There we go. Ooh, oh, that was close. She came to a wide river <gasps> filled with snapping one. crocodiles. She couldn't even swim. So what do you think she did? She went jump. And jump, and jump, and jump. Ah! Oh! Unfortunately, she fell. <laughs> and I died. Wait, that's not what happened. <laughs> she came to a wide river filled with snapping crocodiles. No, oh, and eight one of them ate me. Do so I get an achievement for that? No. Oh, come on. Yeah, I got it. That's right. It was a magical forest where the plants seemed to know each other. She had to use magic mushrooms to get high. Hurrah. Magic mushrooms to get high, huh? Does this branch go up? No. Oh, uh, what? Hang on. How do I? Hang on. Might have to look at the walk through again let's do so quickly the letters oh yeah the salvages are collectibles da, 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 da. oh yeah showing me the asteroid oh Yeah, I missed this section apparently. Oh no, repair the attractions. I haven't gone there that far. Huh. The walkthrough is giving me a thing that I seem to have completely skipped. Yes, I skipped an entire section somehow. Okay. I'm just sort of like looking at the at the walkthrough to see how they navigated this section. Ah, okay. So I actually had the right idea the first time. Ah, don't do that. Oh what? The 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 method that the, the walkthrough said to do. Huh? 
did not work in this instance because he just faced me out but it's meant to work because what should happen is that when this much goes up it takes you with it you're start you're meant to like be able to jump up i'm gonna look that that up again just sort of quickly yeah that's that's not meant to phase me out yeah 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 right like you're meant to sort of be able to be launched up there we go she learned to use some bendy tree branches to fling herself across a patch of deadly sharp bamboo there we go the sun was setting she came to the giant ogre's campsite and there the princess discovered <laughs> Frank and hung him from a tree as a snack. No! The ogre did not appreciate visitors at all. Even Fred seemed a little embarrassed to see him. What am I meant to be doing? <laughs> God damn it. Oh wait, no, I think I, I see what I what I need to do. Yeah me. Ah oh, no, don't whack me. Right, okay, yep. I had it a second ago. Oh, come on. What do you do next? Hang on. Ah, okay. Yep. Okay. But the princess was a woman of action, and she was nimble, and the ogre was clumsy. Oh no! What did you want? That's when you make fun of something. You should never make oh, fun look, of something. Oh look, there's a lifeless and suddenly. Ogre, sometimes you have to. Oh what? Hang on. How did she? How did they do this? Oh, okay, so you need to jump on the thing, right. Hello, excuse. Yep. Yeah. Alright, come down, Fred. Yeah. Oh, did Fred just straight up and die? So the there you are. The ogre and rescued Fred. Ha! Fragile masculinity. The princess. Fortunately, the king told him about a giant spider that he could slay in order to win the princess's hand. So Do you need me to fight the spider now? The layer of the giant spider, singing a brave song, a little less loudly than before. After several days had passed, the princess got to wondering what had happened to her future husband. <gasps> so she went off looking for him again. Again. Of course, I have to do my own rescuing around here. A dark and creepy cavern, full of strange dripping sounds, Ooh. kind of like the basement at school. Her footsteps the basement at school. And echoed, until it sounded like someone was following her. All right, at least I don't fall into the void this time. We. Yep. All right, made that across. Soon she came to a vast pit. Filled with vicious, deadly oh, spikes. No. It was much too big to jump over. But far off, she could hear moaning. Oh, that's a bit she, creepy. It might be Fred. So what do you think she did? I know, I know. What? She used an umbrella. What? Like that nanny in that movie. <laughs> Mary Poppins. This is the Middle Ages. Where would she get an umbrella? I don't know, but that's what she used. 
I don't, I, I don't think I have an umbrella. Well, you better find one. You can use an umbrella. <laughs> the kid's the director now. Well, hmm. He manifested oh, an umbrella. Uh, there we go. So the princess bravely threw herself into the air, slowing her fall using an umbrella. Just nah. like that nanny in the movie. She floated down into the cave. Ah! She impaled herself on the bamboo. Wait, that's not what happened. <laughs> I do like that you adapt the story based on what your actions are. Okay, so you just float. The buttons do nothing. Okay. Deeper and deeper they did not forcibly phasing me out. Ooh. Okay, the umbrella gets caught on things. Wait, right. That's not what happened. We're using so many umbrellas for this one thing. Right, so you don't want to get too close deeper and that way either. The cavern she floated. She thought she could hear Fred moaning. Maybe it was only the wind. Ooh, that was close. That was close. That's Fred. Unfortunately. No! Oh. Wait, that's not what happened. I do not like this morning sounds at all. Deeper and deeper into the cavern she floated. <gasps> she thought she could hear Fred Oh, what? Moaning. Maybe it was only the wind. All right, let's float down. Deeper into the cavern she floated. She thought she could hear. Yeah, I think it's sort of the, the motion physics of this is it moves very fast. Can you control the speed. Mm. Ooh, okay. Ah. Finally, she landed softly. Aha. In a spider web. Fortunately, it yeah. was a very old web, and she was able to break free. Unfortunately, the web was the only thing holding up no. a giant boulder. The princess needed to find somewhere to hide. And she died. Oh. Hang on. Where am I going to be going? Here? Aha! There we go. Back up. Suddenly, a giant spider ah! out of the shadow and attacked her. Please go away. She ran and climbed and jumped and climbed, but the giant spider was very good at climbing. No. It had eight legs and the princess only had two. No. Oh God. Oh, I don't like this. Uh, this is gonna be the death of me. Oh, straight up just died by spider. <laughs> Oh, well, that's one way to avoid the spider web, I guess. Ah, oh, no! Who came up with this plot? They need to be fired. Also, why can't the spider get trapped in their own web, huh? No. I 
I mean, look, we're at the point where it's starting to get like very annoying for me because I have an idea what needs to happen right now, which is sort of my skill level that's making this very difficult to negotiate. And I don't think it's fun for people to see me struggle 500 times. But I'll give this a shot. I mean, we do have about another 20 minutes into the stream. It's <sighs> very good time slots are the worst. And will I continue contrast? I don't know. I feel like if I can't get past this section, or, you know, we decide to get to very tricky, like, jumping territory with this, we're not going to be able to see any more stage magicians. You know, the Great Vincenzo isn't going to be, like, much of a thing. If he can't, like, get to the point where you see him again, you know? Ah. Uh. This is so hard. Nope. Like, it might be a thing where I, like, sort of do this on my own time. And then, like, come back. And, yeah, we sort of, like, skipped a few sections live on stream. But you're not having to see me struggle for, like, 500 hours while I do this, you know? I can do the struggling offline. Oh! Oh, we got this far. Hang on. I feel like there's a sort of strategy to, like, the bit with the spider at the end. I just need to see what that is. I just got this walkthrough again. No, it's the same thing. It's the same thing. It's just timing. It's just timing. Oop, and I died. <laughs> like, I guess having a running start helps. Yeah, go down because the spider is up top. Yep, jump over, jump over. Ah, oh, see, see, there's, there's the bit that's tricky because the stupid princess hat gets stuck on the ledge. So trying to jump off, I feel like there's like a, a millimeter clearance. How? Like, like, at what point? Hang on. Ugh. Right, I've been struggling at this for over five minutes. I do not think I'm gonna get through this. Like, I don't want to spend the next 15 minutes just, like, sitting here struggling to get past this. You know, like, that's not gonna be fun for anyone. If you're watching this on the VOD, that's gonna get, like, um... You know, uh, it, it, like it's gonna be even boring when you're on board. Uh, so hmm, what shall I do? I have fifteen minutes, and I'm getting a bit annoyed. <laughs> Don't know if anyone's like watching, per se, beyond our usual gang of uh, bots and Brad's logged off and there's no jazz music in this section hmm question I think can I save Controls. That just tells me even what the weather. Where's help take me? <laughs> it takes me somewhere. To a browser. <laughs> oh no. I just sort of messing with the settings at the moment. Thank you. 
Yeah, whatever. Ah, uh, you know what? There's no law saying I have to stream for the whole two hours. I think we're going to get stuck here over and over. Um, and yeah, as I say, it's not going to be terribly satisfying to watch me struggle for another 15 minutes. So what I might do, I might sign off early. No one's really watching at this moment anyhow. <laughs> uh, so I might just sign off a little early. Maybe I'll tackle this my own time or something. We'll see. We'll see what we do next week. Um, I just want to say Brad, thanks for coming. Raging Richard, thanks for coming. Um, anyone else who came by? Uh, if you want to see me struggle on VOD, you can find this on YouTube when I get to it. Uh, but I might, I might sign off now. <laughs> I'm getting a bit annoyed and then, like it's not fun anymore. So sorry about that. But should be back on Tuesday. Tuesday is a May because I have an event earlier in the day. So I'll see if I got enough energy to stream. Definitely Thursday will be back. When we'll get in back. That's a game I know how to play. Um, <laughs> and Sunday, either we do this again once I get past this annoying area or... I give up at 5 p.m. stream. So, <laughs> yeah. sorry about that. Uh, we might get back to another Ace Attorney. Who's to say? Uh, I hope you have a good weekend, a slightly better weekend than I am having right now. This second is going fine until now. Um, I might catch you some other time. You can find me at Creatrix Terra on everywhere on the interwebs. Uh, Macedon at Creatrix at me.com. <sighs> Compulsion games. Why? Why? Anyway. I'll catch you later. Bye.